Hello everyone, this is financial author Ahmed Dan of Iran Journal. On this channel, you'll find financial, non-financial, and travel videos just like the one watching right now. If you like it, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing. Credit card bonus rewards points shrinking. Today, I'll talk about several credit cards change their bonus rewards points programs. In the past few weeks, I found out that several credit cards are changing their rewards points options. In my last article, I talked about Scotia American Express Gold Rewards. Today, I'll talk about two or three other credit cards that, that have instituted negative changes. The first card is the Scotia Rewards Platinum Plus MasterCard. This is a free rewards credit card that used to give 1000 bonus points every year on the anniversary date. However, MBNA recently sent a notification mentioning that it will no longer provide any anniversary bonus starting January 1st, 2017. This doesn't come to me as a surprise as I was expecting. Uh, expecting various cutbacks on points and features since TD Bank Group purchased MBNA. MBNA used to offer several cashback and viewers points credit cards with generous viewers and features. However, TD is terrible with its own viewers credit cards and it's no wonder they'll make all MBNA credit cards just like their own viewers program with reward, uh, reduced viewers points and features. MBNA is no longer the choice for low annual fee and no fee credit cards since TD starting axing its benefits. There are other credit card companies that offer better deals for low annual fee and no fee credit cards. Next card is the MBNA World Elite Rewards MasterCard. This is an World Elite Series MasterCard from MBNA. This is a travel rewards credit card and used to give or still gives two points per dollar spent on all categories. The best feature of this card used to be the first year annual fee $89 waived. However, TD recently announced that the MBNA World Elite Viewers MasterCard will no longer waive its first year annual fee. So this is another uh, negative cutback from TD. Next credit card I have today is BMO World Elite MasterCard. BMO was one of the few banks in Canada that would allow you to transfer from one credit card to another credit card and still you get the introductory reward bonus points. For example, if you have BMO World Elite Air Miles MasterCard, you'd, uh, you could uh, switch or transfer your account to BMO World Elite MasterCard and you still get the 30,000 introductory bonus points which you translate to $300. However, BMO recently announced that they will no longer give the introductory bonus points when you transfer from one to another credit card. And there are other two major changes BMO announced which would make this card go down as number one travel reverse MasterCard. This card, BMO World Elite MasterCard, used to give 30,000 introductory bonus points when you apply for the first time but now 30,000 bonus points was decreased to 20,000 introductory rewards points 
in dollar terms, that means that you will be receiving only two hundred dollars instead of three hundred dollars when you get the card for the first time. And also, BMO increased the minimum income requirement from seventy thousand dollars to eighty thousand dollars. So these changes are all negative. When one door closes, another door opens. Always keep an eye for new opportunities for great card viewers. And Aaron Journal is here to provide you with unbiased information. Because unlike most other sites, I do not promote any credit cards and I do not receive commissions or compensations from credit cards companies. That's all for today. Thank you.